feel good. Feel like I would. I feel good. I'm gonna try, gonna try, gonna try. Hey gorgeous and welcome back to my channel. I'm Kupana Shimange and this is How I Do Things. The show where you send me your questions and I'll let you know how I would do things. Now you can take it as advice or use it as entertainment. Use it, don't use it. Take it, don't take it. It is completely up to you. I'm just letting you know what I would do if I was in your shoes. Now, honeys, 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 let me tell you something. When it comes to dressing up, there are ways that we can actually dress up to make us feel more confident, okay? We are walking around here dressing up in ways that just is not good for our self-esteem we wake up in the mornings we feel like Gigh. and then we get out of the house and we dress in clothes that continue to make us feel like Gigh. we come back in the morning and we still Gigh, and we wonder why it's because you are not doing anything to try and fix the situation so today i'm going to give you a few tips and tricks on how you can actually dress up to feel more confident to feel like you're the boss when you leave the house make you feel like i'm the sexiest thing that has ever walked this planet so today i'm going to give you those tips and tricks how to make it super easy to look more confident and also to feel more confident in the spirit because of your clothing now if you have any questions that you want to send to me head over to my instagram and look for this picture right here it's on my insta story highlights at kapana on my homepage. you'll find a little lavender circle that says how i do things click on it and you find this picture the show is run by your question so you send me a question I do a video. You want to send me a question? Head over and find this picture. If you have not subscribed to my channel, what are you doing? I know you're going to subscribe soon. Every single day, I launch a brand new video. We premiere it at 7.30 South African time. So if you want to join us for the live conversation, come on through. But every single day, you'll find a new video by moi. But let's not waste any time. Let's get into this video. Number one, can clothing actually affect your confidence? If you ask me, yes. Yes, clothing can make you feel and look more confident. There are certain clothing items that change your appeal, how you present yourself to other people. If you wear a certain outfit and you walk towards a person, the impression they have on you actually changes. And there are certain structures and looks of clothes that actually work on that person's psychology that just makes them feel like this looks like a very confident person. And if you look good, you feel good too. It's just one of those things. You wake up in the morning, you're just like, wow yes man it happens so looking good makes you feel good and feeling good affects your confidence the better you look the better you feel so if you ask me if you can look different and be more confident because of your clothing yes it's a very good start number two never ever start with comparison that's a big mistake that we all make we go onto instagram and we look at what's trending scrolling 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 explore page oh, that looks cute comparison honestly steals the joy away from whatever it is that you're trying to do so do not start with comparison don't go onto instagram look for somebody else's look and then try and copy it trying to copy somebody else just means that you stop being yourself and you try to be someone else there's a look that specifically works for you there are certain items that make you look good and make you feel confident Find inspiration, yes. But as soon as you try and compare or copy someone's look, that's when things start to go wrong. Number three, I'm getting down to the good and juicy tips now. Use the tried and tested. You know, you know that look, that one outfit, that when you put this thing on, had the earth shakes. That's the one that you're supposed to wear. On a day when you want to feel confident, that one, that one when literally everything starts shaking around the world. That's the one you're supposed to wear. So look for that look, wear it over and over and over again. Because you know, every single time I put this thing on, I get compliments. The compliments just, they're just so much. That's the one that you want to wear. And this just leads me to number four. Don't be afraid to be a one trick pony if you know that that is the thing that actually works for you. There was a good period of time in my life when I knew that high waist pencil skirts are my jam. They are also the thing that helped me lend my husband. But those things made me feel so confident. It was around about the time when Jessica Pearson was just doing her things on suits. When I saw Jessica Pearson in those things, I was like, I need structured tops, dresses, and high waist skirts. Why? 
My body is not the most curvaceous thing. However, I know how to make it curvaceous by wearing high waist stuff. And the things that work really well for the female body and made me look like a boss, especially when I was starting my business, was high waist pencil skirts. Honey, every time I was in the high waist pencil skirts, I was dropping bodies dropping bodies so if you want to do the same look for the thing that you know works okay and you want to replicate that style as much as you possibly can that is what a style is everybody has their own individual style so if you know you have this one outfit in your wardrobe every single time you wear it it works you want to ask yourself what about this outfit is the thing that actually makes the earth shake that makes the world move that makes people compliment me you want to try and replicate that as often as you possibly can the more you do that, the more confident you get in your style, the more confident days you will have, and the better you will be at dressing your body. It works. Trust me. Try it. Best time of your life. Okay, so here's the thing. There are certain clothing items that have been proven to be straight confidence boosters. If they don't boost your confidence, then when you're walking on the street, my love, there will be people who will see that confidence in you and they will compliment it or they will feel it. They will feel that power has just walked into the room. So here are a few of those things. And this is my fifth and final tip. There are certain items that are proven to be confidence boosters. The first one is the structured blazer and structured dresses. So a lot of the times these things have structures in the shoulders as well as how they fit. Now one outfit that I really love that really gives me a lot of confidence is my peplum outfit. So I've got this peplum jacket which has got the structured shoulders so it's got that padding in the shoulders. It's very thin that gives me the structured shoulders, makes my shoulders lift and it squares them off. But it's also got the structured body and the exaggerated peplum. This gives me all the confidence in the world. I could be bloated, I could just feel ugh. As soon as I put that jacket on, the, oh, everything's different. So you can look for a more casual blazer, but any sort of blazer is quite structured. And the reason why is because blazers are made with multiple layers and they've got this firming layer that gives you the structure that you want. So as soon as you button it up, or even if we wear it, it keeps the shape that it's been made for. So it will square off your shoulders. It will give you either the shape you want, the straight shape, whatever shape you bought the blazer to do, it will do it, whether closed or open. The same goes for dresses. So I'm not talking about your bodycon dresses that fit to your body. I'm looking at a dress that is structured. It's made in a specific shape and even when you put it on, it continues to carry that shape. So those, these two things, structured dresses and structured blazers, give you so much confidence because they have a posture or they force a posture on you. Here's the trick. Confidence has a posture and that is something that you can do all by yourself by raising your shoulders and putting them back and accentuating the front right confidence moves forward it leans in and that's what blazers and structured dresses do they square off our shoulders and give us a posture and a certain amount of poise and that is what makes us feel more confident and that is also what makes us look more confident the next is tailored trousers oh i love tailored trousers tailored trousers of any sort high waist low waist whatever it is it could be skinny it could be straight it could be your wide leg it could be flare it doesn't matter as long as it's tailored the thing about tailoring is that it's made specifically for your body for you it fits you perfectly if anybody else tried to wear something that is tailored for you it won't fit them as well as it fits you tailored trousers i've got that power honey all over them i've got a number of tailored trousers and they all make me feel so amazing so if you really want that confidence and you don't have a pair of tailored trousers get them just to test it out let me know later the next is a fun skirt with extra frills and extra extraness you know those skirts that are completely unnecessary but every time you wear it it's so much fun so you can have like a maxi tool skirt Ooh, i love those i don't have one yet but i'm looking for one or this skirt that i have i love it every single time i wear it honey i am in the game and it just looks good i always get compliments for it i always feel so good in the skirt every woman deserves one skirt that's got the extra frills extra fun and extra extraness for just being extra that makes you just feel extra confident this works it gives you a mood there are certain clothing items that come with the mood when you buy the skirt you don't just buy the skirt you buy the mood too 
those are the type of things that you want to wear to boost your confidence next is a killer pair of heels that you can actually walk in this is important that little tip that i just gave you actually walk in that is very important it is not nice to be in a pair of heels and you can't walk in those things it's very it's very off-putting for you and it's very off-putting for everybody else so you want to look for a height that works for you if you buy your heels at certain places they will give you heels of, of different heights i always go for the high one i've been trained how to walk i'm good in it if you guys actually want a video on how to walk in heels let me know i'll do it for you so i go for the higher ones and with a secret platform in the front so this is what a lot of people don't know is that if you want your heel to be more structured and give you more balance there's a secret platform in the front so you can't see it from the outside but the platform in the in the front is about that thick that little secret platform helps you balance a little bit better having a pair of heels again gives you that posture you can't wear heels and slouch it's actually very difficult to slouch in heels it gives you that extra bend in your back and gives you that posture and that's why a killer pair of heels is something that boosts your confidence if you feel as though you're in a pair of jeans and you're feeling a little bit sloppy whip on a good pair of heels these are wear these when i wear these i get compliments all the time they've gotten a bit old but i still love them and i still get so many compliments on these heels i know that when i wear these heels i'm not only just going to feel good but i'm going to get a whole lot of compliments as well what pair of heels does that for you look for those and whip them on and feel the confidence rise and finally a leather jacket there's nothing as badass as a leather jacket like a good leather jacket i used to have one and i don't have one anymore and i'm in the market for a leather jacket you know that one that fits you nicely around the shoulders zips very beautifully leather jackets genuine leather jackets are expensive so for leather you are forgiven you can do it i buy four leather jackets because honestly the jacket i actually want basically costs a lot and i'm not ready yet but when i am i am fetching it a leather jacket has a mood again it's one of those items that when you buy it you don't just buy it you buy the mood as well you just feel like a badass you just feel like you own this you just feel like listen i'm gonna walk into a bar and everybody's gonna be like yes missus this is what it does these are items that are just guaranteed to just give you a specific mood and that mood comes with confidence along with it look cl clothing isn't going to necessarily change your whole entire world but it is the beginning of it if you are in a very <laughs> mood when you wake up in the morning finding certain items or knowing that there's certain items that when you wear them you feel so good reach for those and they will help to boost your confidence in the moment and during the day now this is something that not only you are going to notice but everybody around you is also just going to be like there's something about her today i hope that you guys enjoyed this one because i really did fashion fridays are some of my favorite but we're getting into the more functional part of fashion now if you have any questions that you want to send to me don't forget to head over to my instagram follow me and also send me the questions that you have but until next time beautiful people this was an amazing how i do things i hope you have an amazing weekend i'm kapana shimange and this is how i do things Hey gorgeous, thank you so much for sticking around and watching my whole video. I truly, truly appreciate it. Now, if you really want to work on your confidence and find ways to boost it, then head over to my website, www.kapanishmagi.com. You will find a free ebook all about the seven ways to boost your confidence. Now, if you have not subscribed, click on this face right here and you'll be subscribed. But until next time, join me for the live premiere, 7.30 South African time, every single morning. I will not fail you. I'll be there. Until next time. Mwah. Bye. Like sugar and spice. Da -da 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 -da.